Hey folks, I'm Serving Glory, and welcome to part 35 of my campaign of Scotland in the 1220 mod for Total War Attila. And apologies for any deja vu you might be experiencing. Uh, this campaign is certainly becoming quite repetitive. So once again, we've got a couple of uh, Danish armies uh, approaching us. We've got Swiss Confederacy, who built up their army down at Bristol and then sent it north to take Carnarvon. And we have a couple of Burgundy armies here as well. And no doubt more on their way over. In fact, there's a spy. Let's have him. Uh, yeah, you're heading up this direction. Come up, have a look and see if you can spot any more armies. There we go. HRE is sending another army. All these armies here are the armies that they've sent over and beaten and sent packing again in the past. So... Our armies are slowly, very slowly, increasing in size. And I'm hoping that I'll eventually get to a point where a single army can wipe out one of their armies uh, by its own, and that allow me to double the rate of expansion because uh, I've almost got to the point of reclaiming the whole of the British Isles, apart from I'm now at war with France. When did that happen? I could be royally screwed now. Um, France. Is it because I was at war with everybody else and you just decided to join in? Okay, so that helps to explain the reduction in income because we've lost our trade. I don't know that we can win this campaign now. We could just about cope with the HRE and Denmark. But if France starts sending armies over, then don't hold out much hope. Anyway, let's crack on with this. Uh, I want you to come down. There will do. On the move, lads. You come out Ready and make this attack. And they've got mercenary catapult. Uh, so they're going to just stand, I would imagine. And we'll have to advance on them. Yeah, they will stand up in that hill, I would think. And they've got enough cav to make life difficult for me. Okay, so I need to gather my forces and then advance on them. The reinforcements come in to the re right. Okay, it's going to have to be a straightforward advance. Let's have you guys here for now. We'll have you there. The other army has spearmen, so I'm going to um, have a unit of spears on each flank. Archers in behind. The breeders. So we'll have you over here. And the king in there. Start the battle and Yeah, I'm just gonna stand there. Our reinforcements have arrived. Okay. Let's have you three. Join the ranks here. And you in the end. Group you up. You don't have spears. Right there. And 
the mercs who I must get rid of this turn maybe you come in there that's uh, these guys archers Join up with them. And the two generals will have together as well. Okay, let's fast forward. Actually, you know, running you don't need to be. So it's just going to have to be a straightforward advance. What range has the catapult got? There. Thought it was going to be much longer than that. I don't have any other choice. I can't swing around the flanks with our raiders to go after the catapult. Uh, so we're just going to have to go straight up the gut. Okay, let's go with that. Warriors eager for black. Pikemen can start to advance to there. The archers in there. We'll have you tucked in here. There's good there. Skirmish mode. As well. Right. So that gets us well within range of their catapult. I'd imagine they will start moving towards me at some point. You can expect to start taking some fire any second now. There we go. Still a bit of ways to go before we're in missile range. Let's run now. And you take out those crossbows. Good, they're dead. You now shoot them. Shoot them instead, actually. Oh, good, good. You hit them. Okay, you shoot the general. The enemy is going for our general. Protect him. You know them. Go back up there. These guys. You go up after them. You have these swordsmen. Stay after them. You come out here. Them. You form, you charge into these guys, you attack there, 
Let's have you up there. And general units. And general's dead as well. Good. You shoot them. And you to go up there. One of our peak units is going. You turn back and hit them. Okay. You're going to relieve the archers there. You actually attack them. You must have gone berserk. Lost another unit. Not great. Right, you can charge them down. Victory! This is your day. Go after those ones. You can hit them. You go after them. So, so we've won, but we've lost three units of pikes. It's not the end of the world, but just when I thought I was trying to get on top of the army um, situation, I suppose you change your target. After them, because you're not catching these guys. So, uh, yep, yeah, that's fine, that's fine. We could probably just go up to high speed now. Because we're not going to get anywhere really with this army. Uh, too many units have managed to get off the field. Let's go fast forward. You're not going to catch them. We've already got them. And we'll just end the battle. Actually, we only no, three units maybe got off. Potentially four. I wonder if any of my units survived. Two. Uh, they got two units away. That's unfortunate. Still, I imagine they'll take to the seas, head back to Denmark, and I will I think move you back up behind York. We'll go back Your and sit in York. Father be praised! How can I help? Warriors all! And... Yeah, let's... We're not going to spend money on anything else. No, I didn't want to click the encyclopedia. I want to disband the unit. Yes, go ahead and do that. And... Defending our position. Let's go for, I suppose, the warband. Right, no. Come Take the spears. For us, lads. Yeah. Okay. Nottingham 
is too exposed to invest any money in. Uh, so I guess we're just going to end the turn. Can't believe I'm at war with France. Uh, let's move on. Jerry. Well, they're heading over in our general direction. They didn't come straight for us, obviously. We've lost Nottingham. And there's another Danish army there. Okay, so we've just about been pushed back to our starting positions. The Swiss are now going to go and take Dublin. Uh, let's fight the battle. We don't have any pikemen. Um, they've got. I suppose it's not the strongest of armies, but it's a full stack. They don't have any cav, other than the general. So he'll start on the land. Maybe we can take him out quite quickly. They've got another... Well, that's the... Well, what was it? Uh, I can't remember. Uh, Burgundy or somebody. No, no. Um, what do you call them? An army we drove back from Carnarvon a few turns ago that's just sat outside uh, Dublin for a while. That's the general. Okay, let's put our barricade in over here. So they'll all come in somewhere around here. I don't expect anything to head this direction, so we'll so concentrate our forces around these two points over here. And as usual, we'll fight with the stakes and see if we can get them deployed. Do that. I think we'll have two sets of stakes over here facing the enemy would be useful. Uh, come on, I want I saw it something like that. Same over here. Leaves a gap right up the middle, which is not great. No, right, that'll have to sort of do it. Another set over here. Yeah, something like that. We'll have fireballs on each uh, entrance as well. Make sure that they are on the slope and that they fall forward and not backwards as they have been known to do. You're okay over there. I think I'll put these in here just to cause some casualties as they advance. I'd imagine some of them will land over there. Um, so if we put 
these in here somewhere. Yep, yeah, we can. And again, we'll put the sharp stone beds in amongst this. Leave it there. No, not like that. We'll go with that. Right. And unit spearmen. Each entrance. Backed up by axemen. There. I think we'll have you down there. Okay. I may as well stick you up in there just in case. I think we'll leave the cab outside. Move in there. And yeah, you stand in there. Let's go with that. And walk fast forward. So hopefully the general will come in and the enemy has been take fucking. a lot of damage. We will crush the enemy with our greater numbers! Don't shoot it well. I'll give you your targets. Whoa, he's fast. Okay, you guys get ready in case he charges up here. some damage from the towers as well. No! You used the skirmish wood. We've got the cow or exposed over there. Okay. Good attack. Not ideal. Guys are sure. Oh, they're still on the round. That must be the enforcing army. <laughs> this uh, 72 men. Okay, we can let him go just about. Okay, that cow, you can back over here. on the ground. Ok, 
Okay, what are you Send them this uh, the readers over here. Maybe that. No, not them. That's not the readers. See these guys. Come on in. Yeah, you come over those uh, spade traps. Hopefully, take a few losses. Yeah, got one or two. Let's have archers concentrate on them. And actually, you can go and attack. Nothing remains of that power now. Come over here. Broken actually, you stay back here from now then, and you switch your target to there. You target them. I'm going to take these guys, you switch to them, and we'll bring you over here somewhere, in the middle just now. I think that actually did very much good. Yeah, they've broken anyway, so it did enough. You go up there and we'll get you into position. Shoot them instead. You get into spear wall. You guys come back, set up there. That's you. Okay, you come back here then, and we'll have you up in the walls instead. I so like you. And I wanted you guys back here. You target them. You as well. You both attack there. here for now. Stay in skirmish mode. Not taking damage as is. Cav here. You come around there, attack them. Attack 
the general unit. Good stuff, they've broken. You stay up there, don't charge down. Too late for these, I think. Try them anyway. Pull back out. In fact, go and attack them. Form up there. Good, the spearmen are running. Let's attack the general. You go and attack them. Take them out. Back up in the walls just for now. And you go and join that fight. No, 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 stay back, stay back. I don't want you charging into those stakes. So come back here. Bide your time. You attack there. So you come over here and back them up. Just in there will do. You actually ground there and attack. Here, oh, just in time, good stuff. You guys are going to take those axemen. That general is doing amazingly well. 49 men out of 72, and he's still standing there. Swordsman. So form up here. In fact, form up here. If we can get those spearmen to come up towards us, we'll charge them in the back with infantry. Yeah, stay on them, they might break. Let's have you come down here. And send the spearman down as well. We'll have you come and hold this position instead. time now I think and I'm probably I'm gonna to have to time out the battle because that unit's just gonna set out to sea. Two units got themselves caught up somehow. Never mind. Call the archers back now.
gentleman is broken over there. So you can, if I go pull you back, you stand there. We bring you back up here. There we go, that's fine. Finish them off, please. You come out there. You charge down into them. You go after them too. No. You get ready to attack these guys in the back. Huge amount. You take them, and that's them broken, I think. Yep. So it's just these units out here. We can't do anything about. So you come back up here. Let's have one unit of cav, go after them, other units. Can you chase anybody down that's worthwhile? Don't think so. They don't quite get off, I would imagine. Chase after them. And the javelin men, you can come back up in here as well. And with that, I'm just going to fast forward until the end of the battle. Okay, end of the battle. So it's obviously a problem with the AI. I, I don't know how many times, but four or five times we've fought a battle like that, and uh, the AI has just become really passive, not just passive, but just hasn't done anything at all. So another draw, we should have got a victory. I suppose quite a few other units managed to get off. Bavaria, that's who it was, yes. So, yeah, take on the warriors. Swiss run away. We don't have our problems to seek. No sign of the French yet, but we've now got HRE with a full stack, half stack of re rebels, soon to be a full stack of Swiss again, two Burgundians, uh, two Danes and Saxony. So I think I'm actually going to end the campaign here. I don't see any prospect of victory. We're just going to be fighting the same things over and over until I'm worn down to nothing. So overall, enjoyed the mod. Uh, there are that, a couple of things, to, like the AI that we just experienced in that battle. Uh, some of the city maps, uh, I think, could do with some work. Um, but overall, it's a good experience, a good take. Uh, on the medieval warfare so I think I will end this campaign here and I've been thinking about trying out 12 uh, 12 12 so I'll probably do that instead so anyway thanks for watching I hope you've enjoyed this please leave me a comment rate the video and subscribe to the channel if you enjoy the content and hope to see you again next time cheers <laughs>